Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. Sea Chronicles is my name. Thank you for joining me here. Uh, if you're coming on this channel for the first time, my content is usually fragrance reviews. I also do fashion videos and lifestyle videos. So I do hope that you do consider subscribing before you leave. Um, and I appreciate you coming to this channel. And to my returning subscribers, I'd like to say thank you so much for coming back. I appreciate you as always. I have 10 fragrance in 10 fragrances in front of me that I consider as crowd pleasing fragrances okay these are 10 crowd pleasing fragrances very popular uh, fragrances what i have here is nothing new but um i thought that since we are approaching or we are in the festive season uh, some people out there may want to buy fragrances for their um friends family loved ones uh, and they were wondering what to go for these are 10 fragrances which are um you know for women uh, I haven't pulled out the men's fragrance suggestions. And again, like I said, these are popular fragrances. However, I feel uh, these are fragrances where you can't go wrong, okay? Unless somebody has used them before. These are fragrances that you can actually purchase as blind buys, uh, you know, as gifts. You definitely can't go wrong. They are popular for a reason. So I'm going to go straight to the first one, okay? The first one is going to be Amani C, okay? Amani C. And this is the original, the one that was... Uh, released in 2013 there's a lot of fr flankers out there uh i'm not going to you know talk a lot because i've got 10 so i'm not going to dwell a lot on just one i'm just going to give you a rough idea of what it is this has got like um cases it's got your rose it's got your freesia uh it's got your vanilla your patchouli and the woods it's a very versatile semi-sweet fragrance that gives off like a wine like uh, vibe to it uh it's fruity it's woodsy you know with a hit of rose and it's a favorite uh, it's, it's a personal uh, favorite for many so you can't go wrong if you were looking at purchasing uh, this one as a gift okay Okay, the next one that I want to uh, talk about is Jimmy Choo by Jimmy Choo and this is the original okay uh, this fragrance has got uh, without me even uh, spraying it or sniffing it this has got like um, caramel it's your warm spicy fragrance that is mixed with some florals in there there's some fruits as well as some woods okay this is your easy uh, go-to uh, fragrance uh, this uh, you know is a very um, it's it's got the it's alluring okay seductive it's got those qualities so you are likely not going to go wrong if you gift somebody this one it's a really yummy uh, fragrance and you know what you get the most in here is that spicy caramel and, bits and, and some toffee you know so this is definitely one that I know uh, if you did even a blind buy or you gifted somebody they wouldn't be disappointed uh, I'm not talking about sophisticated uh, I mean sophisticated fragrances here this is why I said this video is going to be about fragrances that you've probably seen smelt or you know uh, uh, experienced before and I feel fragrances like that are easy to gamble your money on if you are uh, looking to purchase fragrances as a gift you know or if you're re uh, looking at uh, gifting somebody a fragrance uh, the next one is you know a no-brainer this is la vie abel okay and this is the original la vie abel there's been a lot of flankers uh you know uh, flying about okay uh, but this one obviously is popular for a reason okay this is by Lancome. It's got your black currant. It's got your pear, your iris, your praline. It's got your patchouli as well. I usually like calling this one, you know, a uh, uh, patchouli on steroids. Uh, you know, the patchouli here is in your face. It's a really sweet, kind of toothachey, sweet fragrance. Uh, but it's not disappointing. It's a crowd pleaser. It's a compliment magnet. You will definitely, definitely get tons of compliments with this one in as much as it's been around for a long time. Uh, but like again, I said, it is popular for a reason okay the next one uh, that i want to uh, show you here is also by lancome and this is la nuit trezor okay this is kind of like a darker take on fragrance okay this is going to be like a, your fruity floral caramel with some praline as well some rose uh with the coffee the licorice in there it's got some coumarin and then a lot more notes okay this is going to give you that smoky vibe it's a deal for cold weather weather i uh you know i picked this one and i added it onto my gothic fragrance fragrances so if you are looking to gift somebody who's got that who likes or who's into that gothic kind of vibe you know uh this is something that is not going to disappoint it's you know your really smoky and elegant bewitching sweet uh scent so this is le nuit trezor by lancome okay 
now going on to maybe purchasing uh, uh you know an aquatic fragrance for somebody and you wanted something that is gonna uh, be uh, uh, uh that will not disappoint okay uh, i picked uh versace's dylan blue for you okay uh versace dylan blue this is like your fresh um aquatic floral scent okay and this is ideal for hot weather uh it is ideal for cold weather as well but i feel it uh, performs better in the what hot hot weather okay this is your shampooy uh a bit soapy mass appealing and fairly long lasting fragrance and again you know uh, uh, uh you know 10 out of 10 for the bottle this is definitely a gift that i feel one would appreciate so if you're joining me here or you skipped some parts i'm talking about 10 fragrances within my collection okay that are popular and crowd pleasing and why i've put this video together is for those that want to buy fragrances uh, for their loved ones for their festive season and they were just wondering which ones would not disappoint the ones i have in front of me are very unlikely uh you know going to disappoint if you're looking at gifting somebody these would definitely uh not disappoint unless somebody has actually used these ones before okay and there are ways of finding out you know if you're purchasing a gift for somebody you can just uh you know do your own uh, uh you know inquiries to find out what they would like but these are popular for a reason okay the next one i uh, picked is another jimmy chu okay this is the second jimmy chu and uh this is the, the the only other one i own i only i own two jimmy chus this is jimmy chu fever okay this is fairly new um in the sense that it's less than uh two years old if i'm not mistaken i can't remember what year this was uh um released okay but it's it's not a, a long time ago maybe last year if i'm not mistaken okay uh this is your fruity floral again okay? mixed um it's mixed with your uh, be, uh i think it's benzoin if i'm not mistaken or tong and tonka okay and some sandalwood this is your delicious yummy jammy spicy sweet scent okay so this is for that fun youthful person the person that will appreciate very sweet you know fragrances uh i feel this will not disappoint it also is a good performer it's got a bit of some spiciness uh going on in it there so it's not all it's not all going to be just jammy 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 it's got a bit of a spicy kick to it uh you know uh and uh something in it feels like coffee although uh jimmy chu does not list coffee as a note in here something really feels like uh you know coffee like the the coffee the way it comes out in black opium i do get that uh vibe uh you know it could be i don't know it could be uh maybe i don't know maybe the um mm uh, uh let me not compare it with any other note but there's something here that really feels as though there is coffee in here so definitely this is one that is going to be a favorite for you know that youthful kind of person or person with with you know a playful that pl playful personality i feel they uh you know are most likely going to prefer or like that one uh the next one which is also another no-brainer and popular for a reason is uh black opium okay ysl's black opium this one will always be on a lot of people's uh uh, 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 fragrance um a uh, list of having used it before intending to buy it or you know having come across it before it's popular for a reason okay black opium is your spicy coffee bitter almond uh licorice okay pear and it's got some vanilla in there it's your rich sweet uh, uh, it's your rich, sweet, spicy, attention-grabbing kind of fragrance, mass appealing, gourmand, where if you wore this, I'm pretty sure, you know, you will definitely get compliments. It's one that is less likely to disappoint, uh, you know, uh, one uh, receiving this as a gift. Uh, it's been around for years, okay? I think this one is your 2014 uh, uh, composition. It's been around for that long, but it's held its own because, you know, uh, uh, YSL nailed it there. This is definitely one that will get compliments. It's one that you know has that really uh, uh, uh it's, it's got that energetic uh fashion forward uh really chatty kind of uh, uh I, I, that's what i see uh, that's the kind of individual i see liking this a really chatty person energetic person uh youthful person as well uh and it, it's got some class to it as well but really you know that that clubbing scent as well it falls under this so this is less likely to disappoint and it also has that versatility when it comes to usage you can use this one uh you know in cold or hot weather it's one that just does you know it's what it needs to do you know all year round okay the next one that i have to mention is your Twilly Diomers okay this uh 
first of all, it's an Hermes product. Okay. Unfortunately, mine is a, is a mini. I, uh, you know, I, I was toying around whether I should buy the actual fragrance. So I ended up buying the perfume oil. I've got a perfume oil in hundred ML. Okay. Uh, because the reason why I did that was because of the longevity. Okay. This one is not a weak scent in any way, but you know, I, I wanted it to, um, I ended up settling settling for the oils because you know oils can really give you best performing okay best performance rather okay so this is your ginger it's your spicy ginger okay that is mixed with some citruses uh there is a touch of tuberose in there uh and uh yeah uh, and your white florals okay so this is ideal for summer uh, and it, it, you know i can i picture somebody wearing this flowy flowy floral dress you know a chiffon like floral dress with like a big summery hat this is what comes to mind when I just pick Flory. Yeah, so that's definitely what uh, comes to mind, you know, with this uh, particular fragrance. But it's important to note as well that uh, the person that you're gifting this fragrance must be the sort of person that likes the floral fragrances because this is quite floral. In as much as it's spicy, it does have the, you know, floral forwardness in it. So you have to make sure that if you're gifting this to somebody, they have to be the one, uh, that kind of person that likes, uh, you know, the florals. So the next uh, fragrance that I picked as a popular uh, fragrance within my collection, a crowd-pleasing fragrance and also a, a, an affordable one is Zara's Red Temptation. Okay, Zara's Red Temptation is one fragrance that, um, you know, is popular for a reason. Um, uh, obviously, it is uh, uh, inspired by the popular Maison Francis Kajan's Baccarat Rouge 540. Um, and uh, uh, not only that, it comes at a very reasonable price and it does have that longevity. So this Zara Red Temptation, you know, would be a fragrance that, uh, you know, that would be ideal as a gift for either a male or a female, you know, because this one does uh, have that unisex feel to it, okay? It is that ember moss orange uh, fragrance. It just has the three notes listed there, you know, but uh, this is going to be your... Um, uh, uh, you know, your sweet, your classy uh, 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 fragrance, okay? Your sweet, your classy fragrance, uh, it's going to be uh, the, 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 even the presentation is, is beautiful. I mean, if you were looking at, uh, you know, gifting this to a person, I think they would, uh, you know, appreciate this if they haven't used uh, uh, Baccarat Rouge 540, or if you're gifting somebody who, you know, does not, uh, is not fussy, you know, about a budget, but also wants to smell good. So I would actually recommend uh, this one, which is Zara's Red Temptation. Now, the last fragrance I, I, I had to put on this list, okay, is Ariana Grande's Cloud, okay. Uh, Ariana Grande's Cloud, I would say the presentation, unfortunately, looks childish, okay, uh, because of uh, uh, this, uh, um, you know, plasticky cloud thing that goes going on there. Uh, but for that reason, I'd say if you wanted to gift somebody that's young, um, you know, a, a, a daughter or somebody in college or somebody that is young or somebody that is, you know, uh, mature, but they don't mind this kind of thing, uh, then this would be a recommendation. OK, I usually just put it here because I don't find the bottle beautiful as well. I just find the whole the, with, you know, with this case or without, it just looks a bit tacky to me. So I just decided, you know, in any case, it's one and the same thing. However, I put it on this list because Ariana Grande's cloud made its round, in, its rounds in the YouTube community for a reason. Okay, this is obviously your uh, fluffy, this is your fluffy whipped cream, you know, so it is a creamy, coconutty fragrance. It's got some prayer in there and it's got some woods, okay? Lavender and some musk. So it's your fun, flirty girly, pretty scent that is also sometimes likened to uh, Baccarat Rouge 540, although I, you know, I, I think the similarities here would be uh, po po maybe possibly 40 or 50 percent, uh, you know, similarities. So this is a gift recommendation that I would, you know, I, 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 I suggest for somebody who's, you know, that youthful person, that young person who's at you know, a college or a young girlfriend or something along those lines, somebody who is youthful at heart 
or if it's a mature person then if they don't mind this kind of presentation they yeah then i would recommend ariana grande's cloud so there you have it guys i had 10 fragrance 10 popular crowd pleasing fragrances for you today these i decided to pull out on my collection uh, to give as gift suggestions since we are in the festive uh, season uh, these are fragrances that will not set you back financial wise in terms of your pocket these are not you know really expensive fragrances okay if i must rephrase that it, you know to say set you off financially that is uh, subjective so what i'm basically trying to say is these are not uh, fragrances i would class as expensive really expensive fragrances i think you know i put a mixture there where some are affordable some are in between so they're fragrances that i feel if you gift somebody they're less likely to disappoint because they are popular for a reason they cloud uh, they are crowd uh, uh pleasers so you know if if you had no clue what to get out there these are my recommendations for women however this zara's red Tem temptation is unisex so you can give that to a male as well my name is c chronicles thank you very much for joining me today i hope you did enjoy this uh video i will bring you more content um very soon i'm going to put up a lot more other fragrance groups for you uh because i find that you know it is it, it kind of it makes it, it, it easier you know for those who want to watch uh videos with like uh, fragrances grouped together please do consider subscribing if you have haven't subscribed uh comment and like this video if you like it and turn on post notifications so that you are notified anytime i upload a video please remember to stay safe stay blessed and remember that smelling good is a form of good manners cheers